Primal Fear, an arc mod that's so crazy it'll leave you overwhelmed. But good thing I'm here to walk you through the madness. Start off, we need to go over all the new types of dinos in the game. There are 11 main dino variants in the game that you could tame, starting off with our OG simple dinos. Look at this lovely gentleman, very distinguished, but boring. So our first new variant is the Toxic. Toxic dinos are three times better than your base vanilla creature. They also inflict torpor when they attack. To tame a toxic creature, you're gonna need a toxic kibble. Next up, we have the alphas. These are five times better than your vanilla dinos and can be tamed with alpha kibble. However, if you're cheeky, you can get yourself an alpha otter like this one right here and just give it a fish. That's all you're gonna need to tame it. No need to knock it out or nothing. Up next are the elementals. These are much better than the alphas. However, there's no clear answer how much better they really are. I find it a huge game changer, especially the ice elementals. It can be tamed with basic elemental kibble. Next is going to be the apex. These are 10 times better and can be tamed with apex kibble. Moving on to the advanced elementals. The advanced elementals are much stronger and have better stats than the normal elementals. They come in either dark or light, but they're basically the same. But they require advanced elemental kibble to tame. Moving on to the omegas. These are 13 times better. It can be tamed with omega kibble. They offer buffs for your dinos, which is fantastic, especially for raising your new dinos. Next, we're moving on to the fables. These are 16 times better and can be tamed with fable kibble. Moving on to the black omegas. These are slightly better than normal omegas, and there's a 2% chance of hatching one when breeding omegas. Now, we're going up into the big doggy leagues. We have the celestials and the demonics. Demonics are slightly better, being 30 times better instead of 25 times, but they're both great. They take either celestial or demonic kibble. Next, we have the chaos and the spirit creatures. The chaos creatures do 35 times better. However, the spirit creatures do 40. The spirit is slightly better being 40 times, while the chaos is 35. But personally, I don't really like the spirit creatures. I find them too bright and it kind of hurts my eyes. Instead of kibble like the other creatures, the spirit takes a spirit orb and the chaos takes a chaos orb. These can only be unlocked after defeating the tier four bosses. The buffoon bosses are just way too strong early game, so you better run as fast as you can. Odds are they will kill you. The primal tech creatures are not able to be tamed, but you can kill it and rebuild it. The elder creatures have higher stats and are bigger than the vanilla counterparts, and they're also rideable without a saddle. The maulin creatures have insane speed and can summon minions that fight with you. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe. See ya!